my name is George McGacky. This is The Real McGack. You know Marmite? The name for that was actually invented by former Olympic athlete Daley Thompson. The co-founder of the company Barbara Windsor actually wanted to call it Nut Scrapings. This one here, the Habitious Royale, or Bellody's Pantry. If you look at the beautiful flowers in here, you get pinks, you get a bit of less than pink. Sort of reminds you the colours of that t-shirt that Lindsay Lohan was wearing that time when the paparazzi caught her with her boot popping out. Here, here, here. What do you think of the new beard? That's the way it's going to stay. Deal with it. I do not even acknowledge your existence. <laughs> designed to make really simple snacks really elaborate in order to boost the profits of places like Waitrose. Today we are adding a new twist to the concept of the cheese sandwich. So what are you going to need to make a really elaborate cheese sandwich? Well for this sandwich we're going with a combination of cherry tomatoes, dried herbs, Cheddar cheese, and of course, seeded bread. And in this bowl, we have the seeds that dropped off the bread in the bag. Because nothing says a cheese sandwich on seeded bread and making little extra bits get caught in your teeth. First step is to moisten the bread with olive oil spread.
viewers will have noticed that I have actually used the outside slices of the bread rather than inner slices in a sort of ironic fashion. Next you move on to your cheddar. A lot of people would prefer to use a cheese grater, but I'm using a knife. I'm slicing it. A new twist to the cheese sandwich. Then you put the cheese onto one slice of the bread. You'll be thinking, these look a little bit round and bulky for a sandwich. What do I do there? You slice them. Sprinkle the herbs. Add in the little bits that get stuck in your teeth. Now it's time to drizzle. secret ingredient. How do I make these sandwiches taste so great? Antidepressants. Crushed and grated some antidepressants into a bowl. Just sprinkle that on the top. And put the lid on it. was invented by the late Bob Monkhouse. Hello, I'm here for my date with... Oh my! You're more beautiful than I ever imagined! Thank you! And you're very handsome too! I think I'm really falling for you. 
I think I'm really falling for you, too. Really? That's amazing. Okay, hold on a wee second. What the hell do you think you were doing? I'm not that type of drum. Oh, oh God, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I didn't realize. I'm sorry. Well, sorry isn't good enough for me. Take me home. Take me home now. Okay, okay. I'll take you home.